In 1986, an American made his mark in Paris. Greg LeMond became the first American winner of the world's most famous bike race, the Tour de France. We've already seen several examples of how events in 1986 were intriguingly linked to events of a previous athletic generation. But there were also performers in 1986 for whom there was no historic precedent. Among them, Debbie Thomas, who became the first black world champion in the history of figure skating. Ann Butler has a look at that story and other headlines from around the world of amateur sport. 1986 was the midway point between Olympiads. And as amateur athletes around the world began to focus on Calgary and Seoul, this was a year in which we saw virtuoso performances by established Olympians, as well as dazzling surprises from stars of the future. One of the most brilliant stars of the future is Debbie Thomas, a 19-year-old pre-med student at Stanford University, following in the tradition of Peggy Fleming, Dorothy Hamill, and Rosalind Sumners. Thomas was the challenger in East Germany's Katarina Witt, the defending world champion and 1984 Olympic gold medalist. The last year's world, I didn't skate that great. I mean, I placed high. You know, I had the fourth place freestyle, but I didn't really skate my best. And that's what always happens when people compete against Katarina. They go out and they mess up. Triple Sacco! And it was a big one! So, a gold medal for Debbie Thomas, who took the lead in the compulsories and then held on to win. Another American, Tiffany Chin, took the bronze. Next up, the most difficult... And for the men, another program. surprise. Brian Boitano, also of Sunnyvale, California, struck gold, too. He is on! At Nationals, I was hoping to be here in top shape, not even wondering if I was going to win or not with my ankle. But I just went out there and tried to be a warrior, and um, it came through for me. In the pairs, the sensational Soviet teenager Sergei Grinkov and 14-year-old Ekaterina Gordaeva stirred memories of the legendary Soviet pair Rodnina and Zaitsev. And the Soviets also captured the ice dancing, as the dramatic duo of Bestia Manova and Bukin thrilled the crowd with a stirring display of passion on ice. In skiing, Switzerland's Maria Valliser won the Women's World Cup title, while Mark Girardelli of Luxembourg won the men's overall title.